The soup is lovely as is, but a dollop of cream to finish it off makes it even better. And yes, you can just pour a dollop of creme fraiche or some whipping cream, but to make this extra special, I like to mix the two together. In one bowl, I add a few tablespoons of creme fraiche, and creme fraiche has a really mild, tangy flavour to it. And I'm going to add a bit of piquancy to it with a little bit of mustard, along with some extra spice, some cayenne pepper, just a little pinch, and the zest of half of this lemon. And you could use some parsley or some tarragon, but my choice of herb is some chives, a big amount of chives there, because it goes so well with any type of soup. I'm going to start by giving this a really good whisk, just to blend this together, and a hint of salt. Great. Now that the first element of cream is done, we can get onto the whipping cream. Now, this whips in 90 seconds and it's really going to hold its volume because the combination of the tangy creme fraiche and the lightness of this whipping cream is going to make this mousse-like, which is a really nice touch. So we'll just give this a really good whisk. So this is lovely and thick. Stiff peaks is what we're after. And now I'm just going to fold in my flavoured creme fraiche and I'm going to put the whole lot in together and just very gently fold this in. See that consistency? It's as light as clouds. And I'm going to put a big dollop on some tomato soup, but this also goes really well in jacket potatoes or even on some smoked salmon in the morning. Yum. Look at that. Just floats right on the top.